everyone, welcome to my channel. I'm Regine Tolentino and today we're going to talk about makeup. So my question for all of you is, what's inside your everyday bag? And in your bag, how many pieces there are makeup? Ilan ba ang piraso nito? Ano yan? And is it effective for you? Well, today I'm going to show you my naman. Ako, for my uh, everyday makeup, I have this. It's kind of big, but because I have to work in my office and sometimes I have shoots, I have this makeup kit. And then when I have bigger events, like corporate events or like when I have shows out of town or corporate stuff or like a concert or what, this is my makeup kit. It's really big because I like to have a lot of choices. Here in my makeup kit, I have three palettes of eyeshadows. I have a palette for contouring because I love contour. I have different shades of lipstick. I only have one mascara and I have eyelashes, curl lash, and of course my favorite, the shimmer pang J-Lo shine. So that's crucial for me. So it's complete and there's a lot of eyebrow products here as well. Um, I love to do makeup because since bata pa ako, nagme makeup na ako since my mom was a makeup artist, and it's just fun for me to explore different brands and to try them all out. Kaya I can spend forever in makeup shops, lalo na pag may tester sila. But anyway, today para sa inyong mga working moms, um, mga single ladies who are working as well, or people with a very busy lifestyle. Shempre hindi nila kaya magdala, hindi nyo kaya magdala ng malalaking makeup kit when you're traveling or working or busy. So it's very practical to have a few essentials that you can bring around with you na madaling nilagay sa mga bag. Diba? So today, we're going to talk about my top three picks, my uh, makeup essentials, the items that I recommend, and here they are. So let's start with my first product. This is concealer. So concealer is crucial for me because I have eye bags and I have uh, in the T-zone, uh, hindi pan tayo aking skin tone. So I use this concealer to conceal all of the imperfections and the uneven skin tone. I also use this to to conceal some of the parts where I have dry skin patches and um, even around my lips as a base for my lipstick. So, again, a first product. After that, I have this cheek tint that I also use as a lip tint and sometimes I also use it on my eyelids and even as an eyeliner if I want to have that hangover look and maybe even bring it around towards my nose para cute lang. <laughs> and then last but not the least, Kila is life. So I have this eyebrow pencil that I use. Um, I make sure that it's the right shade that matches my hair color and my skin tone and my Kila of course. Um, I already have a Kilai base because naka ano na yan, naka embroidery na yan kay Alberto. But I use this to define it more and I like my brows a little bit thicker. The consistency of this one is really nice because hindi siya masyadong waxy and not too soft. So when I apply it, may form talaga siya, lalo na when it's newly sharpened. So yan siya. There's no excuse for me not to be fresh every day because these are my three makeup essentials na dala ko lagi sa aking bag. So I've already applied moisturizer, that's how I normally start my day, and then I can go straight by putting on the concealer. Because I have nails by tips and toes, um, I usually use my fingertip to apply, but today I'm going to use this brush to apply the concealer. So I try to keep it very, very light because concealer that I like to use is one shade lighter than my skin tone because I'm acidic. And I like it measure thick because I have long days and I absorb makeup very fast. So I'm gonna put a little bit of this. It has full coverage underneath the eye. Okay, so, yan siya. Then, kilay mo na. Do a little bit thicker, go very, very light. Other side. My cheek tint. I chose this particular cheek tint because it's not too heavy. I've tried so many different brands and some of them 
when you apply it, especially when you use it on the cheeks, masyado siyang matapang, kailangan ikalat ka agad, and it's quite stressful. So ito, medyo watery, so it's not too stressful to put on because you have time to spread it around. And it kind of has a gloss when you put it on. And since this is light, I put a few layers of this on my lips. And I like my lips to look a little fuller, so I will go overline my lips. Okay, I'm using the same. I'm gonna put some on my cheeks. I like rosy cheeks, so I'm gonna bring it all the way out from here to the side. And for today, I'm gonna put a little bit on my eyebrow, on my eyes as well, just to have a little bit of color. And I'm gonna put a little bit under as well. Today I'm gonna to go for the hangover look. <laughs> so you can bring that up and then spread it out more. Bring it up a little bit higher. And then that's it. There you have it, this is my fresh look. This is my easy to do makeup using my top three makeup essentials. These are the items that I recommend, the concealer, the eyebrow pencil, and the cheek and lip tint. So I'd love to hear from you guys. I'd love to know what your top makeup picks are and any requests. So please go ahead and follow me and subscribe to my channel and check out the links below. And I hope you can hit the like button because uh, I'd love to hear from you guys. So there you have it. Thank you. There's no excuse not to look fresh and beautiful every day. Always be your best.